Hi there everyone, welcome to my channel. And then in this tutorial video guys, we will answer another requested machine problem by one of our subscribers. So in this machine problem, we will solve a factorial a number using for loop statement using C programming language. Before we start, I would like to shout out Sir Ernel Marshmallow and Miss Robelin, our three avid viewers and supporters and subscribers in my channel. If you would like to be shout out in my channel, kindly leave your name and then put a message shout out in the comment section of this video tutorial. If you are new with my channel and then you like this video, please hit the like button. Don't forget to share and please support my channel guys by clicking the subscribe button. So let's get started. I'm using Dev C++ as my integrated development in writing this program. So we have here, sharp includes tdio.h. In C programming, tdio means standard input output header file, int main. It is a function in every C program that is being executed by our C compiler. And then we have here begin. Left curly bracket. And then we have here several variables declaration i, pack 1, number 0, int a0, par, chx, for multiplication symbol, and then car equal for the equal sign. Line number 9, we have here two new line. In line number 10, we have here factorial, a number using for loop in C. Backslash T means horizontal tab. The purpose of this is more on the output formatting. Line number 11, new line. Line number 12 to 13, we are asking the user to give a number. 14, new line. 4i equals 1. i less than or equals to 100. i increment, pop factorial pop equals pop multiply by i close horizontal tab and then here another for loop statement a equals number a greater than one decrement if a equals one space so display to this to spacing a character a the character a is your number no? and then ch and then equal sign here in decimal factorial and then new line here line number 32 and the program new line return zero meaning return to the operating system and then we close here okay so don't worry guys i will put a link in the video description where you can download the complete source code for free let us execute compile and run our program Okay, so factorial a number using for loop in C, give a number 5. So we have here 5 times 4 times 3 times 2 times 1 equals 120 and a program. Okay, another example. Let us run. Let's say we have 7. So 7 times 6 times 5 times 4 times 3 times 2 times 1 equals 5040 5, and a program. So this is the end of our tutorial video guys. I hope that you learned something new in this factorial number using for loop statement in C programming language. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and please support my channel if you like this video by clicking the subscribe button. See you in the next video tutorial guys. This is your friend Jake saying bye bye for now.